Hey, have you ever wondered why the smell of coffee is just so darn irresistible? I mean, seriously, what is it about that aroma that makes us feel all warm and fuzzy inside? It's not just one thing. It turns out that coffee has over 800 different aroma compounds. Yeah, you heard right, 800. It's like a crazy complex chemical symphony playing in your nose. So, how does this magic happen? It all starts with the green coffee beans, but the real transformation occurs during roasting. When those beans get heated, a whole bunch of chemical reactions happen, creating those volatile aroma compounds. We're talking pyridines, quinolines, pyrazines, alcohols, phenols. It's a regular chemistry party. Each of these compounds brings something unique to the coffee scent profile. Some give it fruity notes, others add a buttery richness, and some even contribute to that nutty aroma we all love. And get this even tiny amounts of these compounds can make a big difference in the overall smell. Factors like the type of bean, where it was grown, how it was processed, and even how you brew it all play a role in the final aroma. It's like every cup of coffee has its own unique fingerprint. And here's a fun fact the roasting temperature is super important. If you roast the beans too light, you might miss out on some of those delicious aromas. But if you roast them too dark, you can end up with a smoky flavor that overpowers everything else. But wait, there's more. The size of the aroma molecules matters too. Smaller molecules tend to be more volatile, meaning they evaporate quickly and give you that initial burst of aroma. Larger molecules, on the other hand, tend to linger longer, giving you that more subtle, long-lasting scent. Oh, and let's not forget about the bitterness. That's not just from caffeine, but also from compounds called chlorogenic acid, lactones and phenylindanes that are created during roasting. These compounds, along with others, contribute to the unique taste and aroma of coffee. Now, here's a little tip to keep that amazing aroma around for longer. Coffee is like a fresh food. You want to keep it away from air and store it in a cool place. That way, you can enjoy that incredible coffee scent for as long as possible. So, next time you take a whiff of your morning coffee, take a moment to appreciate all the science and artistry that went into creating that magical aroma. It's way more complicated than you might think. Hey, are you as fascinated by coffee science as I am? Then you need to check out subscribe, like, and set notifications. You might learn something new.